it's Taylor. Welcome back to another video. I make videos on this channel about health, wellness and leveling up in your life. Here it is, my typical evening work routine and I'm also going to be throwing in some self-care practices that I typically do a few times a week if I'm lucky. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed this video. Leave a like if you do like it already. Subscribe to the channel if you find these type of videos useful. It is about 7 p.m. I don't always work out in the evenings. It's just something I've been doing lately because I've had a few things crop up through the week that I've had to do during the day. Tonight I've decided to do some yoga and just roll out my brand new yoga mat which I love so so much. It's made out of all sustainable materials and I will link it down below. I also love yoga with Adrienne. I just find her videos very calming so highly recommend if you want to do yoga from home. shower time. Firstly I start wiping my makeup off with some Swispers wipes and sometimes it's a bit of a struggle so then I have to pull out some Sukin micellar water and scrape off the rest of my face. <laughs> once I've taken off my makeup I like to tie my hair back because I only wash my hair once every three to four days. Then I jump into the shower. Do you guys like my fairy lights? Let me know down in the comments. I love using the Body Shop Tea Tree Face Scrub because it's vegan. And so is all of the good oil Byron Bay products. At the end of my shower, I really like to smash on the cold water because it's really great for your skin and immunity. Hashtag Wim Hof Method. I'm putting on my new PJs I got for Easter. Thank you, mum and dad. And these PJs are actually made out of recycled plastic bottles and they are super, super comfy. Let's go, round two. Jade rollers are believed to boost circulation and help your skin products penetrate further into your skin. They also help drain your lymphatic system. I've had a bit of a rough life. I bought this in my Byron Bay Van Life vlog and I will link that up above but this stuff has been really, really great on my skin. I just put this on my face after I tone this has been really amazing. I've had some really great results since using this. You can buy this stuff online as well and it's all herbal based and vegan so definitely check them out. Look, I've got hardly any left so I'm gonna have to use something new soon. Here we are at the main event, dinner tonight. I made some potato chips seasoned with herbamare and the barbecue sauce from the health section in Coles. Piers made us these amazing black bean burgers with mother bread patties and greens from the garden. So delicious and super nutritious. And you know what else is a part of my evening routine? Super exciting guys. <laughs> taking the washing off the line. But for real, I actually love taking the time to tidy my space and do chores because I actually find it meditative and, well, you know, it's got to get done anyways. I love making a hot cup of cacao, especially since it's starting to get colder in Australia. I use homemade oat milk date syrup as a sweetener because dates are the best and raw cacao.
cow is packed with antioxidants, magnesium, and it just tastes bloody great. Now that Taylor has her beverage, you know she can get to work. Here I was working on editing a tech review video which I published a few days ago which you can click up above if you'd like to check that out. But I really like to edit at night time because I find I don't get distracted as easily. I generally like to go outside and do things during the day so that's why I tend to work at night and a lot of people would say that's not too great but don't worry, I never stay up too late and I always practice prioritize my sleep. Once I'm done editing for the night, I really like to wind down with some self-care and tonight I decided to do some journaling and self-reflection. And also some reading. I'm currently have just finished the Bhagavad Gita and I've just found it super super deep and philosophical read and I would love to share with you some of my favorite excerpts. I honestly think everyone should read this book and if you do enjoy these little excerpts I will be placing a link down below if you would like to get yourself a copy. A sage seated behind the Ganges notices a scorpion that has fallen into the water. He reaches down and rescues it only to be stung. Sometime later he looks down and sees the scorpion thrashing about in the water again. Once more he reaches down to rescue it, and once more he is stung. A bystander observing all of this exclaims, Holy One, why do you keep doing that? Don't you see that the wretched creature will only sting you in return? Of course, the sage replied. It is the dharma of a scorpion to sting, but it is the dharma of a human being to save. Better indeed is knowledge than mechanical practice. Better than knowledge is meditation. But better still is surrender of attachment to results because there follows immediate peace. So I've done my heavy reading for the night and the Bhagavad Gita is great. But I also do love a bit of lighter stuff too, like some sitcoms on Netflix. Does rebranding mean they're redesigning the store? No, we'll be taking our in-store product and changing it to super cloud. And how are they different? That, uh, what I just said. It used to be called Halo, now it's called Super Thank you so much for watching this evening routine. I hope you enjoyed it and found it relaxing. Please smash that like button. It really helps in the algorithm and subscribe if you feel inclined. Also stay tuned. I am going to be heading on quite a big trip soon that I'm very excited about. So click that notification bell if you would like to be notified of my new videos. Until next time guys, stay chill and keep your vibes high. Talk soon.